Hello everyone, this is Dr. Vikhar, Consultant Pain Specialist at Alleviate Bangalore. Today we will be discussing about shoulder pain. Shoulder pain, the most important is your rotator cuff tendons. Tendons are nothing but the muscle becoming hard and coming and attaching to a bone. In rotator cuffs, the most important is your supraspinatus, where one of the pathology which can happen is calcific tendinopathy or cal calcific tendinitis in which there can be deposition of calcium hydroxyapatite crystals which can cause pain, which can cause impingement. The patient might complain of painful arc where lifting the hand becomes quite painful. There are different stages of these calcification which can happen in your tendon. That is the pre-calcific stage, calcific stage and post-calcific stage. In the calcific stage, there are three stages again, which is formative stage, which is resting stage and resorptive stage. In formative and resting phase, usually the patient does not have so much of pain and is quite asymptomatic most of the times. But in resorptive phase, the patient might complain of pain. The reason for that is the calcification which is actually there becomes very soft and liquid form and that could actually cause severe pain because not only is the calcification within the tendon, it also spreads into the bursa or the space above it which is called as subacromial bursa. So how do you actually diagnose it? Many a times when we do our ultrasound scannings and x-rays, we'll be able to actually pick it up. But sometimes it's not that discreet uh, in your resorptive phase where actually the interventions or the, the procedures are indicated in which we actually can do barber touch where we put a small needle under ultrasound guidance and we can repeatedly aspirate out the uh, chalk-like material or the paste-like material of the calcium crystals. The second is fenestration where you can put a small needle and try to break the crystals. And third, we'll be putting some amount of anti-inflammatory like a corticosteroid injection into the bursa. If you have any further queries, do call us, mail us or even better, pay us a visit. Thank you.